friends, I'm back like I said I would be. And today, I am going to bring myself to Florida for some nice Thanksgiving vacation. But first, I'm going to attempt to swap myself with like a bird or something, I'm not sure. So, three, two, one. Hello Sycamore, today is our last day of reporting to school for the next week. Next Monday and Tuesday, we stay at home to work for our student personal learning days while teachers have their professional learning days. Happy Friday, all. Today is November 18th, and welcome to this episode of the Daily Video Announcements. I'm Charlie. And hello, guys. Me, of course, I'm Sarah. Let's all stand and place our hand over our heart and join Mr. Foley's flex class to honor our amazing country where we live as we say the Pledge of Allegiance together. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you all and please be seated. Please be respectful, be responsible, be safe, and be a problem solver. As we wind down celebrating International Week in collaboration with the International Club in their celebration after school today, Deanna is here with our next special guests, Sam and more special crew questions. We asked Caitlin Jarvis while she was in the studio. Over to you, Deanna. Okay, so Sam, when did you move here? I moved here like in July because... July? Yes. Okay, what country are you from? I'm from China. From China? Do you go there for vacations a lot? Yes, um, I, I would go there for vacations. Yeah, yes. alright. Uh, what do you miss the most about your home country? Mm, family, mm -hmm. friends, uh, and um, life back there. Uh -huh. yes. Yeah, okay. What's your favorite thing about studying here in America? My favorite thing about studying here is that it's an interactive environment mm -hmm. and also that um, it has um, maybe a difference in education mm -hmm. than maybe yeah. back there. Mm -hmm. It's uh, kind of a creative form of education. All right, okay, thank you. Do we have anyone else on set who wants to ask Ms. Jarvis questions? All right, there we go. So what is your favorite country that you've ever gone to? <laughs> this is probably the hardest question you can ever ask a traveler. I have a top three that is constantly evolving, mm -hmm. but I would say right now my favorite countries are Algeria, mm -hmm. Uzbekistan, mm -hmm. Ethiopia. I'm going to give you my top five, sorry. <laughs> and I really like Syria and Lebanon as well. Okay. All right. Yeah. Any other questions? Oh, uh, yes. Which one had like the most beautiful landscapes? Like which one had a, an amazing view? There are so many beautiful landscapes in the world. I'll say the landscape that I was most surprised by was Yemen. Mm -hmm. In Yemen, it's just so raw and untouched and it touches the Indian Ocean mm -hmm. and it's just beautiful and blue and there's these cliffs that just drop straight off into the ocean. <laughs> Yemen had the most beautiful coastlines. All right. Uh, okay. Anything else? Uh, yeah. Uh, how do you deal with different government changes and like different, like, I know we have a very different governments in a lot of different other countries, so how do you like deal with that when you first come to a new country? Yeah, that's a very good question. Um, the Quick answer is just lots of research. Mm -hmm. And you just have to be open to accepting other forms of government. You may not agree with them, but you're visiting their country. Mm -hmm. So you just do the research and then you follow their laws. Mm -hmm. You may not agree with them, but it's for your safety and it's also respecting mm -hmm. their government and their culture. Yeah. So it's just yeah. like a lot of research. Okay. Mm -hmm. Anything else? Um, so out of Food-wise, what is the favorite thing you've ever tried and where was it? <laughs> uh, so I love Middle Eastern food. I, I actually just got back from Iraq and I cannot remember what it was called, but it's this, it's like a, it's rice, lamb, and chicken mm -hmm. cooked inside of this bread ball with more rice and golden raisins and you just tear it open and it's this like steaming, medley of savoriness. It's amazing. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay, one last question. Okay. How many passports do you have? Actually, I just went through my fourth passport, mm -hmm. uh, so I'm sending that one away and I'll be getting my fifth passport soon. Oh, that's cool. Thanks, Diana and guests. Thank you for sharing International Week with us. And if you would like to see the full interview with Caitlin Jarvis, 
it is out on our Sycamore Junior High School News Crew YouTube channel. Some very exciting news was announced yesterday. We are going to have a school winter dance on Friday, December 16th from 6.30 to 8 p.m. Tickets will cost $5 each and will go on sale this, the week of December 5th. A maximum of 250 people are allowed due to space limitations. More details to come. I'm going to make sure that I want to go. Yeah. I'm gonna, yeah. Creative Writers. The deadline for the Montgomery Women's Club Creative Writing Contest is December 14th. Contest information is on the Montgomery Women's Club Writing Contest. Google Classroom Code PGHDLQA. Write it down. Again, the code is PGHDLQA. Be watching for some more PBIS first class ticket items to be announced in the near future as well as the Traskiball Flex Bell event information coming to us us following Thanksgiving break. What are you doing for Thanksgiving? I'm gonna have like a big old turkey with like, you know, a bunch of stuff in it. Yeah. And then I'm just gonna eat it. Yeah, relatable. Yeah. So. What are you doing? Um, I'm gonna like go to my grandparents' house and have like a big family dinner. Well, it's more like a lunch and like we're gonna eat a whole bunch of desserts. It's gonna be really good. I'm still going to eat my turkey. Good. Yeah. That's, that's really good. Well, I hope you enjoy. Yeah, I hope you enjoy too. Oh gosh, thank you. <laughs> Next up, National, National Day! Today is National Princess Day. Oh my goodness, Sarah, what's your favorite princess? Bro, my favorite princess is Tiana. Bro. Yeah, I love her. My favorite what's is yours? Merida. Next up, Birthdays! <laughs> Happy birthday to Mr. Heffron, Santiago G, and Rylan J, who are celebrating today. Enjoy your special day. Also, happy birthday to all those celebrating over the weekend. Mr. Brenna, Maya M, Emma P, Nathaniel R, Ethan M, Ma Liam M, and Dulce D, as, as well as those celebrating throughout Thanksgiving break. Gwen M, Isaiah D, Jayshawn K, Izzy W, Ethan L, Quinn E, Nathan R, Sian G, Owen H, Anna O, Nikki L, Marley P, Nihal N, and staff mis members, Miss Rutledge and Miss Alleman. Happy birthday to all of those celebrating today and over personal and professional learning days, as well as Thanksgiving breaks. It's yeah. a lot of birthdays. It's a lot of birthdays. Next up, Mr. Harris. Good afternoon, Sycamore Junior High, and welcome to your daily video announcements. All right, uh, we don't have a whole lot of announcements today. It's the last day. You guys are getting ready to enjoy a nice week of uh, Thanksgiving break. Remember, be thankful for what you have. There are lots of others who have less. Enjoy your time with friends and family and all that other stuff, and we'll see you in a week, okay? All right, the only thing we have today is International Club. You will meet today. Members, be sure to check your email in the Google Classroom for details. So International Club, you're going to meet today after school. And again, you guys have a great Thanksgiving break. Remember, check your Google Classroom and Learning Guides. I think you have some personal learning days in there. So check to make sure that you're getting your stuff done so you don't have to worry about that when you get back. Have a great vacation, a great weekend. We'll see you next week. Thank you, Mr. Harris. And now for our joke of the day. I'm Emily, and I'm here with Mr. Teets for the joke of the day. What did the turkey say to the hunter? What? Quack, quack. Thank you, Mr. T. That was a good one. Be grateful, <laughs> be grateful for our international opportunities, Sycamore. Smile. Be kind to everyone, even Charlie. Yeah. Do your best to be great, Sycamore. And go! Yes! Have a happy Thanksgiving! Yeah, eat your turkeys. <laughs> Whoa, how did I get here? I was just sitting on a beach after migrating. Man, what happened? Well, happy Thanksgiving, everyone. Make sure that you're eating turkey and, you know, like not flamingo. Hello. I was just back from Florida. I made a new friend. Enjoy your Thanksgiving break, everyone. If you're traveling or not, stay safe and have a good Thanksgiving.